for tuning in and now on to the show. Well, hello everybody. Welcome to this exciting episode of Bob the Sign Man. So from time to time, I have to use my phone for work a lot. Uh, I record videos for personal use and stuff and uh, I have to take pictures for work, you know, sign pictures and stuff. So I have an iPhone and I use the phone to take the pictures and then to download them, I always have to hook up to my computer the pictures. I have the OneDrive, and sometimes it takes hours for the videos to download and stuff. It's just a real pain. So I come across this way to download everything directly from my iPhone onto a flash drive. All I needed was a little adapter. Now I have the iPhone 15. I don't know how this works on other iPhones, but the new iPhones that have that lightning port, it's a new... Um, uh, new port at the bottom of the phone uh, they changed it and it's really kind of neat now that I like it first I didn't like it because none of my other stuff worked with it so then all you have to do is just take the adapter plug it in plug this into your phone and you can download the videos from your phone onto a flash drive and then you can um, you know uh, move it around on your computer um, various folders or whatever you want to do I do recommend um, I store all my photos that I take off my flash drive onto an external drive so I always have copies of them and then then you can download them up to your OneDrive or your iCloud wherever you want to save them but uh you know like I said I use my phone for work a lot and uh, this might come in handy for some of the stuff you have to do at work you know if you have to take pictures of signs and stuff which I always have to do and uh various things like that so let's jump into this exciting episode and I'll show you how to do it it's a real quick easy fix Okay, I'm going to show you an easy way to download a photo or a video from your iPhone onto your flash drive. My flash drive is already hooked up to my phone, so I'm just going to come in and open up a photo location. And I've got some of these uh, photos here um, and videos. Let's, let me find a short little video. Here we go. Here's a 9 second video. Here's a 10 second one. It doesn't really matter. Just hold down on it. And now it's going to give you the options. I'm going to share it at the very top with the little box with the arrow in it. Click share. And then I want to save it to the files where it says save to files. Just hit that. And it's down at the bottom. You can see the image. So what we're going to do is we're just going to come up to the top right hand corner. We're going to click save. Okay. We'll shut down that screen. And you come back to the files where we saved it. It's You want your file icon, which is the white icon with a little blue folder in it hit that and you want to go to on my phone okay so there's the, the video that's on the phone so what we can do is we're just gonna tap on it and we're gonna where it says copy we're gonna hit copy okay and now down to the bottom right hand corner where it says browse we're gonna come over to the browse and our flash drive is plugged into our phone see where it says no name we're gonna tap the no name okay it says this folder's empty we're just gonna hold down and we're going to click paste. It'll take a few seconds. The longer your videos and the more videos you do, the longer it's going to take. Sometimes I'll do 10 at a time and it might take five minutes or so. So there's your video. And what I'll usually I'll do then, I don't like to keep a lot of that on my phone. I'll come back to the um, browse where it says on my phone and I'll just um, hold down on that and where it says delete at the bottom, I'll delete it off of my phone. And now it's on my flash drive ready to go. Real simple and easy. Well, there you go. There's a little uh, how-to video on how to download pictures from your phone onto a flash drive. Real simple and easy. Um, you know, I struggled with downloading pictures for quite a while. I watched some YouTube videos, and they have use all this fancy equipment. I just bought a pack of these three from uh, Amazon, and they didn't cost me more than about eight dollars. This other stuff, you have to download all this apps and get all these other connections and all this and that you don't need all that stuff just keep it simple keep it easy and just turn to the sign man as always thanks for watching thanks for watching this exciting episode of bob the sign man filmed in the beautiful napa valley bob the sign man directs produces and edits all of his own videos to learn more about where bob the sign man gets his materials and sign supplies check out www.bobthesignman.com as always thanks for watching See you soon.